Hey y'all, in some of my previous videos, I showed you all the 60% PCB I designed called the Flygon 60. After I tried the PCB in some pre-made cases, I decided I wanted to try making my own case. So in this video, I'm going to show you all my first acrylic case design and at the end I'll do a sound test too. Let's get started. Now because I don't have thousands of dollars to throw away, I decided that instead of trying to design a metal case out of aluminum or brass, I wanted to make a stacked acrylic case. I started by importing my PCB outline into Fusion and created some offsets to get the basic outline to use for the other design cutouts uh, for each of the different layers. Next, I wanted to figure out how many of each different layer I would need um, to cut for the full case. Because I'm not very visually spatial, I tried to make the 3D versions of the case pieces and assemble them in Fusion, but for some reason I was having too much trouble, so I ended up scrapping that idea and just decided to make a best guess. Once I reviewed all the plate cuts, I loaded them into Inkscape and started cutting everything on the Glowforge. For the materials, I decided to use a 1.5mm thick palm for the plate and a 3mm thick acrylic for the remaining case pieces. I used palm because I enjoyed the sound of a palm plate and also it was the perfect thickness. Now let's look at all the pieces all cut out. Overall, I think the cuts are pretty good, um, but I need to check my laser settings because some of the pieces have some sort of ribbing along the edges. I think this is due to the laser making small cut bursts instead of a long constant cut. Other than that though, I think the pieces came out pretty good, so I moved on to assembly. I started by soldering all the necessary components to my PCB and quickly moved on to attaching the stabilizers and the plate. Next, I peeled, assembled, and screwed all the case layers together using some standoffs in between the layers. I used standoffs so that way I could easily take apart the layers in the future, and also acrylic cement is really hard to work with. Now that the case was fully assembled, I placed on some keycaps. I just got this set called PBT Notion, and I think it was a good fit because of the clear and white case colors. Now here it is. Overall, I think it looks pretty great. I mean, there are some flaws, like the USB cutout is way too large, and there is some edge chipping from the laser cuts, but overall, I think this is an amazing first attempt. Now, let's finish the video with a sound test. If you like this video, please make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. It helps me grow the channel and it helps other people find my videos too.